Okay, so I'm going to show you how to build and run your first XNA game on Ubuntu. So the first thing you're going to need is to install Mono Games development stuff. So bring up a terminal and run sudo apt get install mono develop mono game. This will want to install about 150 meg of stuff on a completely pristine Ubuntu system. So say yes and let that get on with it. Uh, in the meantime, which versions of which distributions let you have this? Uh, here's a little list. So four distributions with a little bit of a time lapse. So today, right now, is Friday the 29th. Uh, the package has just hit Debian Unstable, uh, which means it should be pulled into the development version of Ubuntu very soon. There's a 10 day delay from when packages go into Unstable before they go into Debian testing. And for anyone running the long term support version of Ubuntu, I've already uploaded it a version of the package along with the latest mono developed to my personal package repository badgerports.org. So you see it's done installing in the background. We can close up this terminal and fire up the IDE. So we create a new solution and you see under the C sharp project types is mono game Linux application so we'll give it a name and store that in documents just click through that you don't need to change anything and it'll bring up the sample code so what do we do with this uh, let's try changing a couple of things so let's make it run in a window Let's change this color here to, I don't even know what BISC is as a color, so let's try that. You hit the compile button, you hit the run button, and there you have it, your first XNA game on Ubuntu. So this should open up opportunities for porting of existing XNA code from Windows, from uh, Xbox 360, uh, from Windows Phone, and if you're an existing mono game user on Mac, on iOS and on Android, it should also be very easy. Just take your project and run it straight away uh, with a simple recompile in mono develop on Ubuntu. So uh, I look forward to seeing what kind of projects people come up with as a part of this, and thank you for listening.